Right, hear from the little girl who is making her once-in-a-lifetime wish a selfless one. Yeah, you bet. When does a small wish turn into a dream come true when it's one answered for a sick child? Get your tissues ready. And we'll introduce you to a king and his court that all need forever families. A big wish for a little girl battling a brain tumor is coming true in the show. The Alabama Make-A-Wish program came through for her, but her wish caught our attention. A donation will be made in Annika Glover's name to Paws. Pets are worth saving. That'll be in the Shoals tomorrow. It's a big donation for a small wish from a child. WFF 48's Marie Waxwell joins us live in our Shoals newsroom. Yeah, Marie, you talked with Annika about her wish. What does she think about it coming true? Well, I did, and Annika tells me that she didn't think it would happen. Tomorrow, the Make-A-Wish program will donate $7,000 to the Paws group here in the Shoals, all in her name. I wanted to help animals a whole bunch, and I wish that I could help animals. From the outside, nine-year-old Annika Glover looks like your typical fourth grader. But inside, she's been battling a brain tumor for the last two years. The Alabama Make-A-Wish program stepped in and granted Annika one wish. Her wish to help save animals. Because I grew up around animals, and I love them so much. It's a love the nine-year-old says comes naturally. I don't live in a neighborhood and I live next to my grandparents, so I go, I'm go. i surrounded by nature and my pa grandparents have pet goats and I go and feed the goats and I live around a whole bunch of animals. The Make-A-Wish program is donating $7,000 to the Shoals Paws Group an organization dedicated to fulfilling Annika's wish. They spay and neuter animals and try to get animals from being hurt or killed or anything. She went through a really tough time, really tough time. Annika's mother, Ann, says they're thrilled the group is helping to fulfill her daughter's wish. She's here for a purpose, and as much as she loves animals, I think that's her purpose, is to get others to to help animals as well. And the greatest wish of all has been granted to the young girl whose future was once uncertain. About two weeks ago, she had an MRI, which she has to have every six months now. And it was clear. The MRI was clear. All the blood tests are back to normal. She's healthy now. And now this, she gets to get back. Now today, I also talked with volunteers at Pause. Coming up at 6, hear how they say Annika's wish is helping their dreams come true. For now, reporting live in our Shoals newsroom, I'm Marie Waxel, WAFF 48 News. That's a great story. Well, that's right. Officials tell me the money will help save hundreds of pets. They also say with Annika's help, they'll be able to save lives and raise awareness. There's a phrase about raising a child takes a village. Well, I think helping animals takes a village. And we all have to pitch in. And whether it's with time or money or this miraculous wish that she was able to grant us is, is just phenomenal. Terry Whalen with Paws says Annika's wish is also a dream come true for their group. She could have wished for anything. And she decided to use this opportunity for the greater good. The Make-A-Wish program is donating $7,000 to Paws of the Shoals. With this money, we'll be able to spay and neuter approximately 70 animals. And in turn, not only will it save their lives, but it will save the unwanted births of approximately 390 just for one litter each. So we're talking hundreds, and then multiply that over the years by thousands of animals that will not be born and go homeless because of what Annika's doing for us. Annika's small wish comes with a big message. Don't hurt animals on purpose. Don't, don't just let an animal run into the street with you looking and saying it'll be okay. And hopes to inspire the community to foster and adopt. Do it. It's so easy and fun, you can do it. Now the donation will be tomorrow at the Paws in the Park event. It will be held from 10 to 4 at Wilson Park in Florence with the check presentation set for 11 a.m. Mark and Liz. Just amazing. This little girl took this money. It could have been for anything, you know, Disney World, anything, and, and gives it. I mean, this way. And Liz, Liz had a great line earlier. She was. It really is a double blessing because she got some really good news from the doctors two weeks right. ago.
It is, it is. They said she's healthy in the MRI. I came out clear two weeks ago about the same time that the Make-A-Wish program granted her wish, so it was just a miracle for all parties involved. All right. Great, great wish. Absolutely, great story. Thanks. Karma all the way.